Welcome or welcome back to my channel, my life's journey black. My video for today is about the Philippines first international shrine. It is also the third in Southeast Asia and the 11th in the world. Before I will continue this video, if you are new to my channel and haven't subscribed yet, please do subscribe, hit the notification bell so you will be notified of the new uploaded video. The National Shrine of Our Lady of Feast and Good Voyage, or popularly known as the Antipolo Cathedral, was formally elevated to an international shrine this first quarter of 2023 thus making it the first in the philippines and the third in asia and ranked 11th in the world the marian image of the our lady of peace and good voyage or the virgin of antipolo was brought in from mexico in 1626 and enshrined in the antipolo cathedral and has a continuous following among Filipino Catholics since the Spanish colonial era. This beautiful cathedral is located in Antipolo City, Philippines, and Antipolo City is popular for being a pilgrimage site. It prides itself as the pilgrimage capital of the Philippines. The Cathedral's beautiful round shape with colorful windows has great aquatic. You can bless your religious items or car right after the Mass outside the church in a special designated area. The National Shrine of Our Lady of Peace and Good Voyage officially assumed its new status as an international shrine last March 25, 2023. The cathedral announced that it received the Vatican decree elevating the church to the rank of International Shrine. Whether you're seeking a spiritual renewal or a different connection with your faith or simply a place of peace and tranquility, Antipolo Cathedral is a destination that will inspire and uplift you. Join the millions of pilgrims who have made the journey to this sacred site and experience the timeless beauty and enduring spirit of Antipolo Cathedral for yourself. Our Lady of Peace and Good Voyage is the well-known Virgin of Antipolo, a wooden image of the Blessed Virgin Mary, profoundly worshipped in the Philippines. It is known that the Philippines were invaded by the Spaniards and ruled by them for more than 300 years. That's why the Spanish influence is very evident in the Filipinos' looks culture, and most of all, their Christianity. It's quite noticeable that there are a lot of churches in the Philippines. Christianity is really a big part of our culture. One of the most celebrated holy images, the Black Madonna, is being held as sacred in Antipolis Cathedral. During the construction of this church in the 1630s, the image would mysteriously banish several times from its shrine, only to reappear atop a Tipolo breadfruit tree. The image pedestal is supposedly made from the trunk of the Tipolo tree, which also gave its name to Antipolo itself. The church is situated at the center of Antipolo City and it is easy to find. Because of the sacred image, this church attracts millions of devotees from all over the country and the world from May to July each year. 
The bodies are being allowed to go upstairs near the image of the Blessed Virgin Mary. You will notice that it's very well maintained and you will smell the fragrance of the flowers brought for the Virgin Mary. It is better to visit the church on weekdays to experience its solemnity and make sure to wear appropriate clothes as a sign of respect for the church. Thank you for watching this informative and updated uh, information about Antipolo Cathedral. And now it is called the International Shrine of Our Lady of Peace and Good Voyage. See you again in my next vlog.